Truckers XTV on air. We are now live in three, two, one. Okay, welcome back to another exciting episode of 13 Central Ages Rim. In the previous episode, we did. We did Fuyu Saka son's story. Prologue story. Today we're gonna right now we're gonna go Takatoshi's Hijiyama story right now. Prologue story. After this episode, make sure that like button is greatly appreciate the channel and we'll see where this story, prologue story goes and see how long. And we may continue where we left off in the main timeline story, so. Yo, are we allowed to like do stuff? A few save datas, but uh Hmm. The blue, red, and yellow. Gee, I wonder what all that stuff means. We got an autosave and this. Is it a good story, bad story, and neutral story, or what? I wouldn't be surprised to be honest, but we'll see how this goes. Sure. Hopefully, if it is that type of thing, then... Then, oh boy. Because <laughs> I have no idea what we're supposed to do if it... 1944 no not the world war 2 looks like they're starting to panic down there the sooner i'm out of here the better that's weird someone changed the shifter's access key huh not that it matters carry yourself huh so, you came after me, Hijiyama-kun. This has to be some misunderstanding. You can't be a spy, can you? Hmm. Sounds like the professor, all right. So his... let's see, if it's 1944 and this leads to 1985, his grandpa right here, I'm assuming. Why did you run off? The military's looking for you. They think you stole some kind of intel. But you're the professor's daughter. You can't be a spy. It doesn't make sense. Sorry to break it to you. I'm not his daughter. The real Kiriko Doji is still over in Tokyo. What? But the whole spy thing's kind of a stretch. I don't need to steal any secrets on the Sentinels. I'm the one who built them, after all. Professor Doji led the Sentinel Project for our efforts in the war. His daughter, Kiriko-san, came along with him, but... What does it mean if this isn't her? In the World War II, or what? Or is it some different type of war? Is she serious? She says she built the Sentinel herself, but... Is she serious? She's... I'm not sure I believe this. You built them? Yeah, that was me. I drew up the designs in an editor. Then I just had to send the order in to an automated factory. But that's... No, you're probably just confused. That's all. I even implanted the linking component into your head. Though, you wouldn't remember, of course. Anesthesia and all. When you came to the factory, you said you were there on behalf of the professor. It was as good a cover story as any. Professor Doji led the Sentinel, his daughter. What does it mean? If you're not the real Kiriko, then... Then who are you? You wouldn't believe me if I told you. Or maybe... This really isn't about who I am. Maybe it's just about what you feel towards me. I... Uh, <sighs> You're kind of a simple guy. There's something about you, though. What are you even saying? I'm saying... I'm gonna miss you. But my key just finished decrypting. So, that's it. 
This is goodbye. Wait, he loves you. Or whoever the heck you are. She's going to the future. Kiriko-san? She vanished? That's impossible. It was barely a moment. She can't have had time to run into the mountains. Where did Kiriko-san go? Oh, someone's coming. Oh, he's the one who snuck into the factory. There's something fishy about him. But if he's working with her, then he might know where she's gone. I'll hide behind a tree and see what he's up to. Tokisaka Shrine, huh? If this log is right, Okino just crossed over. Might still catch up if I'm fast. Coordinates read Sector 4 in the year 1984. Give it up. There's nowhere to run. Professor Doji, his daughter, what does it mean? You know Kiriko Doji? Yeah. I knew it. Though that wasn't actually her, of course. Is that really true? She said something along those lines, too. She, huh? Must have been pretty convincing, then. His real name is Tsukasa Okino. He wears that stuff for his own reasons. What? Don't joke about that! You're just trying to confuse me! This can't be true, can it? Was the Kiriko Doji I knew really a man? This Tsukasa Okino? Hijiyama. So you're the spy. But there's no escaping me now. I'm not even sure if I'm what turning on the mic here? back and forth, but at this point I'm just writing some face. dumb stuff as of right Answer now me. while we're, uh, we're, we're avoiding all this you. stuff. So, I'm yeah. going to time Awkward. travel to another era. Is that a joke? Or are you just insane? <sighs> Is 1944 people are all about time travel? Who knows? He's just playing games with me. Time travel? Really? This is reality, not some penny dreadful. You're going to time travel, huh? Try a better story next time. This Kiriko Doji of yours? He did it himself just moments ago. Escaped from here into the future. I'm not falling for your lies. I don't have time for this. Step back. I'm going after him. Well... So you do know where she went. Where? Show me. You don't want to get caught in this shift. Keep your distance. Right. Your time travel. I'd like to see you try it. Don't say I didn't warn you. You took someone's grandfather into the future, unless he's... Wait, this is not, 1984? That means he, he overstayed his welcome into 1984 to <laughs> 1985 to one show. year later. He so... You'd beat his ass mm. watching his son. Probably shitting his pants right now. Turned tail and ran, huh? Guess he didn't have the balls after all. Whoa, hold it. What? So that was not the gra grandpa. Uh, well, that's not a descendant. That's actually him, because he went to 1984, and to 1984, one year later, trying to find the dude, and now here's the man today. 
Alrighty then. Noodles stir fried in sauce, enfolded in sweetened bread. I don't trust much in this post war world. But if there's one exception, it's my yakisoba pond. Don't give me that shit. Nearly knocked my friggin' arm out of its socket. You wanna apologize? Oh, did I hit you? Sorry about that. You're sorry? Sorry don't pay my goddamn hospital bills. So? I don't have money, if that's what you're after. Wait, Wajima-san, I heard about him. People been talking about this guy. He's the one who's been snatching all the jackets. The hell? Wait, yeah. This guy's wearing one of our uniforms. Oh, so you know the guy who owned this. I don't have any relatives around. I'm basically homeless at the moment. So the clothes and the cash were a really big help. He was a generous guy. Tell him I said thanks. Take care. Dang, so he was stuck in the past? I mean, stuck in the future? And he tried to and he spent one year finding the means to survive? Hey, don't you walk away! Come on! My yakisoba pun! I didn't even get a single bite! You just made a big mistake, punk. You got a problem with me, buddy? You're the one who's about to have a problem. You heard him, boys. Sick him. Stop! We're sorry! Look! We'll get you another snack, man! I've got no mercy for people who waste food. Especially Yakisoba Pond. What the hell happened? I thought you called me out for a fight, Wajima. Someone want to tell me what I missed here? And who are you? A friend of theirs? I'm Nenji Ogata from Sakura High. I didn't ask you to fight my battles, pal. Wait, it's you. You're that jacket snatcher. Uh, Hijiyama or something. Takatoshi Hijiyama. At your service. I told them I didn't need the help. But they wouldn't take no for an answer. Yeah, I'll bet. Drop the tough guy act already. I could say the same thing. Don't go picking fights you can't win. I've heard enough, douchebag. And you owe me a fight. Was that the further than Von Eyre? Come at me. Well, you're gonna regret it. <sighs> Come at me. Bring it! What the... Well, look at this. I guess you fit right in here in the 80s. Here, I figured I'd have to check up on you. She is a dude! I know that voice. And that face. Wait! Oh, no. I came for a fight, and I'm getting one. Out of my way, damn it! Ferdinand, now it's not the time to play games. Out of the way. Before dawn. Higo Romo Cho like Abandoned ba Factory Alley. This is about where I last saw him. Her. For he your feelings. Close by. That bastard kicked like a horse. Pretty tough for a thug. He almost had me for a moment there. Okay. Where exactly are we investigating? I forgot we could do this. Can we climb up the stairs? Examine. 
Looks like it's locked. Okay. So. Huh? The dude. Or whatever. Did he just dress up to become her again? Guess you found me. Kiriko san. Were you looking for me all night? Still as reckless as ever, huh? <clears throat> Don't try to talk around it. I. I know who you are under those clothes. I figured you'd be here soon, so. Got some breakfast for you, too. Half a year I've been searching for you. Half a year thinking of what I'd say to your face. I got you some yakisoba pond. You didn't get any yesterday, right? You got yakisoba pond for me? Hey, look, that, that's not the point. Take me back to my own time. We're going. Whether you like it or not. And if I say no, what'll you do? Push me over? Pin me down? I would never. Besides, you're a man, aren't you? Why don't you find out? Why are you uh, blushing? Where's your pride, man? Uh, this consider. Can't be true, can it? Was the Kiriko Doji I knew? Really a man? This and Tsukasa Okino? So you're actually Tsukasa Okino. Why do you wear women's clothes? Doesn't feel great to hear you say it like that. You weren't complaining when you confessed to me. Uh, <clears throat> I'm not exactly the picture of masculinity anyway. Better than trying to pass as some militant with a buzz cut. So why are you dressed like that now? Because I know you like it. Uh, oh. You're a funny guy, Hijiyama-kun. <clears throat> let's say some binaries work for me and others don't. This lets me hide the fact that I'm even alive. Professor Doji led the scent of his daughter. What does it mean? Why disguise yourself as Kiriko-san? Even convincing everyone you were a girl. Professor Doji thought it'd be a good idea. See, he's... Well, all Shikishima's tech really began with him. Shikishima made incredible strides after the war. And a lot of that was thanks to his work. Though it didn't hurt that I taught him about his future's technology. But why? Why would you make that deal with him? For the Sentinel. Is she serious? She says she built the Sentinel herself, but... So what did you plan to do with the Sentinel? It was an accident that it showed up at all. It was never meant to be there. I mean, come on. You've seen it. You think they could make that back in the 1940s? Even here in the 80s, it's out of our league. That's not human craftsmanship. It was made in the future, in an automated factory. Let me put it in layman's terms. There was an incident, and it got broken. Our goal was to fix it there, so it could fight again. But wasn't it meant to be used against the USA? Uh... Then who or what was it made to fight? Never mind. I have to get back, no matter what. If we can finish the Sentinel Project, we can win the war. You're a good guy. But kind of an open book, you know that? Say whatever you want. I don't care who you really are anymore. Just get me home. I know about the air raids. And Okinawa, Hiroshima, Nagasaki. I can't just let those attacks happen. I can't let those people die. So you did some reading in the history section. Be 
between all the manual labor you've been doing and your living conditions or well lack thereof you're a lot more determined than i expected you've been keeping tabs on me i do have one suggestion there's something i still need to do and that something is here in 1985 i just need you to wait until that's finished Actually, I'd really appreciate your help with it. It does involve you, after all. When it's finally all over. Then... You can ask me to do whatever you want. How's that sound? Anything I want? No, I... What I want is to go back to my own time. If you're sure. Still, think it over. My base is over there on the second floor. Where are you going? I'm wearing the uniform. Where do you think? Oh, right. Your yakisoba pawns on the desk inside. Wait a minute. Wow, was that your stomach? You haven't eaten anything since yesterday, huh? Go ahead. The door's unlocked. Wait a minute. Is she the four-eyed girl that we met at school and uh put the glasses, do her hair bag, keep the ponytails? I think that's her. Let me get the bread. I'm here to get this bread, you know what I'm saying? Manny's tall. Okay, we get the bread. Where do you go now? Maybe he really was just manipulating me. Well, it is Yaki Soba Pan. Not much I could do. Well, as long as I've got it. <clears throat> so good. The sauce is so sweet, yet so spicy. I hit the spot. If he's in that uniform, he's probably going to school. But what's he trying to accomplish there? For now, I should find Okino again. It won't do me any good if he slips away. I might as well check my old school. Alrighty then. That's it for that prologue. Oh boy, wave three. Do we have time? Do we have time? Let's do the thing. Because it should be short and simple, and it's him and us. Three minutes later. Sentinels are incredible weapons. That war has been over for decades, Hijiyama. The dude! You can stop worrying about it. We will never stop until our foes lie dead. I'm not about to forget my duty, Yokino. Where to next? Don't get ahead of yourself. We're not done here. Reinforcements. I see kaiju gathering from across the whole city. I'll release some more drones to expand our search range. Good. Leave the fisticuffs to me. What I'm worried about is the G-molars in the back. You see them? G-molar? Is that what you call the big round ones? No, G-molar. As in, with the letter G? It stands for... You know what? Never mind. A G-molar is a dimos built for excavation. It uses the spinning blades on its back to dig into the ground. They need to bore a path to the terminal. It's the core of their strategy. And we need to stop them. A slow poke like that? All I need is one strike to take that one out. They can withstand intensely high pressures and break through any rock. If you underestimate it, you're the one who's going to get taken out. Is that where they're headed? Yes. 
That's the point closest from the surface to the terminal. But your Sentinel's a first gen, which means more mobility. That'll come in handy here. Can you take out some kaiju on your way there? I don't have much choice. We're going in. Okay, let's figure out this game. Are we by ourselves? Destroy all kaiju. If the terminal destroyed, we have to move. Use powerful armaments will consume EP. EP is gradually replenished. Defeating enemies, but you can replenish faster by defeating charge EP. When you use defend charge EP, you'll be unable to move temporarily. It's not. What are the only ones? You're trying using the armament leap attack, which consumes. First, we have to move, right? Nope. We're gonna use leap attack. Oh! Wow! Ay, 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 whoa, whoa! Okay, go for it! Booyah! Let's go. Bow down. Okay, move. Go for it. Oh, the moment that we move, they move. Leap attack, go for it! Perfect. I was unbelievable. I'm acting like an amateur. Okay, okay, I'm starting to get a hang of it. Can I please do something? Let's see. Go for it. Hello? Okay, there should be one more. Is that the other one over there, or? Rush attack! More. Gotcha. I need backup! By gathering the meta chips from the feeding enemies, your meta gauge in the bottom left screen will increase. Use the meta skills when the meta gauge is filled up. Open the menu triangle and use the meta skills phase plasma EMP. I guess these guys don't like me. Go for it! Perfect. What did you just do? The terminal forced a shutdown of designated targets within range. That was amazing. Let's fire off some more of those. Can't. Don't know if we can do that, but we have a couple other tricks up our sleeve. Let me take a look. Okay, we just keep on fighting, right? The only mana skill you can currently use is the EMP and use it only once. Gotcha. Once some X answers are available, you'll be able to lock blah blah blah. Let's continue on fighting. Work. Leap attack! Go for it. Is it enough? Thank you. But how long does it take for me to charge? I guess life comes at you fast. There's only one more left, so. And th and this is a nice way to tell about the enemies. Catch up to it. Unbelievable. I'm acting like an amateur. Boy, they, they move slow. Damn it, we left it defenseless. Whoa, what happened? You just 
activation confirmed. All the hostiles in range destroyed themselves. Like magic. If we had that kind of weaponry, you should have told me. Why bother with the Sentinels when we have this? It takes time to activate. And if we get taken out before it's ready, then it's all over. It means the terminal would be fully locked down. Nobody could ever open it again. Is that a bad thing? This is Renya Goto. You are one of the compatible pilots from Sector 5. Who are you communicating with? I'd really rather not deal with this. Don't tell him, Hijiyama-kun. No one. I'm fighting solo. Sentinel signals detected. Sentinels are being activated in another location. Number 17 and number 19. Just how many Sentinels are online now? So we made it through. The city is 87% safe. Not even bad. Hey, it's homegirl. Natsuno Minami. Alrighty then. Well, that will end today's story right here, ladies and gentlemen. Like, comment, subscribe. Shark is next team, and I'm signing out.